That sure does look like snow. Some big, big flakes too. I don't know. Eh, well, this is not the subject of this video. I guess we'll get back to what I really plan to do. Welcome to another exciting episode of Dusty Electronic Repair Bench. Hi, good morning, YouTube. <clears throat> As you can see, the snow is falling out there. I showed you that a second ago. It's already diminished to some thin flurries now, so I don't think it's going to amount to much. Uh, I want to bring you back here this morning to continue on this uh, just briefly. I am, I'm going to show you what I decided and what I came up with. So I'm going to do that on the post up here if I can get it going. All right. Let's see, let me let me tilt this up, get a little better view of it. Get a little more light on the subject. There we go. Now, getting back here, I'll show you what I'm looking at. This is the part where the cage goes over over it here, all of this here. So, uh, normally this guy had his coming out. Uh, I'm gonna put this here temporarily just to show you. He had his coming out the side here, and that's just a not, uh, unacceptable to me. I don't see that happening at all. Uh, what I propose to do on this is uh, get some uh, block of wood. <laughs> Put this, prop this up so we can see what we're looking at. There we go. Now, what I propose, you can see there's already a hole here with this wire, wire going through it here. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, there we go. There's already a hole there. The the wire that, that goes through it is shielded, but I don't think there's that hole has much to do with the leaking out of the signal. I, apparently, so what I'm, I plan to do is drill a hole somewhere in here. Maybe not right at that spot, but somewhere near this hole, maybe up in here. And mount a little SMA connector. That was the uh, connector he had on the side of the uh, box outside there. And it will come out here. And I have a, a cable in mind that will run down through here over to here. I guess I can follow my finger. And go through the uh, outside there into a BNC connector. And it's all sealed cable and there's no need to add that foil like he did. And from inside there's the solder connection. It will go right over to here where it needs to go. And solder to that. And I think that should just about work perfectly. Um, I had debated on whether or not to uh, just take that uh, pilot lamp out pilot light, whatever you want to call it, uh, because I thought, well, you know, I can move the pilot light anywhere. It's it's not a, it's not a, um, oh, what am I trying to say? It's not a um, precision thing to where it has to be any certain thing in any place, and, and that's true, but uh, I think I'm, I'm going to leave it like it is. I think I have plenty of room there, as you can see. There's quite a bit of room there for uh, a BNC connector right there. Let me get a pencil or something to be easier to point to. But yeah, right in here. I think uh, right in there is what I'm thinking. Right even with that uh, pilot light. And the one I have is a, is a bulkhead type connector. It'll go through and and uh, secure from the front or back. I don't know which would, which it was, but whichever it was it'll secure and comes through with the cable runs up to the SMA connector and I think that's going to work out just great so that's the that's the finalized plan that way when when uh, if this does has to be taken this I can't talk this morning if if the cover does have to be taken off for some reason uh, that will not get in the way of it this stays here it goes with the thing so the cable will be able to, to remain there and it won't have to be taken off each time. I just think that's the best course of action to uh, do this. And I think that's going to be the easiest way of doing it. So 
that's my plan on that and uh, again I have the parts and they, I think they both were US sellers so uh, they should not take too long to get here but I don't know exactly how much money I've got left in my account so I've got to figure that out once I figure that out I can either order them or wait until uh, my next check comes in which is uh, I think the 17th and it may be a little later now I can't remember but anyway third Wednesday of the month whichever that is uh, between now and then I will get those ordered and I've, I've got to wait for the other parts to come in anyway so for the uh, meter and stuff I, I'm, I'm just I'm doing all these things at once and I don't like doing it that way but I am doing it that way so uh, now that's it for that and uh, we're gonna set this aside briefly uh, also in the meantime I, I, just one more thing I can do that cord there's a couple things I can do to this I can replace that I can replace the cord I'm gonna do that 